I've been penciling in monochromes with stardust and hanging them under the sun so when people call me high strung, it just looks like I'm noteworthy enough to become another moon. Children said they'd become astronauts to visit when they grew up. And they take the time to study me like an art piece that was made by some genius who hypothesized enough for us to learn their names so we could flicker and the shimmer of the same wonder that pushed us to crack open geodes that traced our paths in the galaxies with their crystals just so we could find that no one is going to look back at our tracks like we will and all our hope for someone to ask us where we've been. I've been hiking up a storm, one big enough to tear the skin off of prickly pears and let it stir underneath naive chests that continue to gasp for themselves even as they drink in the murals of the wind. I've been chasing after my own footsteps because the places I see myself going are always three strides bigger than where I've been geocaching stories and always hoping for more than what I could give, more than where I'm from. I've been making fortune tellers play marbles with their crystal balls, trying to knock my handmade Polaroids out so they could make sense of a definite future. I've been saying love like I'm quoting everyone who has said it before me instead of saying love like a made-up word. I tripped over, man, that kid's got purpose. Another quote, I've been calling myself an empath, but I'm starting to think I'm just indecisive, or maybe I really am an empath. They say indecisiveness is the product of too many options. Well, I've been trying to choose, but how am I supposed to know how to choose when everyone saying purpose says it the same way I say love, like the guy next to him just whispered it into his ear and said, pass it on. You see, I've been making my rounds off of this telephone's bad connections. I've been making my rounds with gunpowder scraped off the floor with credit cards, and I'm worried that when I take a shot at my future, the soot is going to backfire. I've been omnipresent in my anxiousness, and I've been saying the same prayer every night for it. The same nights I go to poker and look at a deck where I see myself four times with four faces, but in the end, it's four too many suits to wear for me. I am royally screwed. I've been shuffling my feet against the sea floor, so when going with the flow, I know I'm not being taken away by the current that tries to cauterize my wounds with its burning salt water. I've been here. I've been here waiting for the things I loan my faith out to to make the next time I see them sweeter than honey. I've been here hypothesizing about love for anything that would make realists say serendipity. That boy has found serendipity.